What's up, cows? I'm really feeling like a G because look at that. Look at look at them edges though. Yes. Look at the baby hairs. <laughs> Shout out to Wild Growth Oil. <laughs> Shout out to Wild Growth because it has really helped. You can see me. Girl, it has really helped me in my time of need. They were like thinning out because I was neglecting my hair. I wasn't giving my hair a break with the wigs and stuff. So, I mean, I'm going to insert some clips of what my edges was looking like prior so i'm about to put on my wig and then i'll be back what time is it it is 2 22 haven't eaten haven't really done nothing i've just been working um i just recorded a wig try on haul i'm about to go take some pictures in this dress because it's super cute and it's just like so springy and sundress season is upon us so i'm just gonna go ahead and take some pictures in this dress because I know I'm going to get questions. I already posted a little video on my uh, Insta story on Instagram. So, <clears throat> and you guys are really liking it. And then also, y'all, I'm really loving this wig. I don't know. It's just so, I don't know. I just look like I got like a kid or two. And uh, I don't know. I just look like somebody's mama, but I'm like, I'm real sexy. You know what I mean? Does that make sense? You know what I'm talking about? I look like somebody's mama. Like, I got, like, I, I work an executive type job. I got, like, two kids. And my, my husband makes good money. <laughs> that's what I feel like this wig looks like. What y'all think? I think that's what I look like. I look like I got at least two kids. I got an executive type job. And my husband got a good job, too. So... Like, maybe he works for, like, a law firm or something. And I'm just, like, going to go take him some lunch. <sighs> Anybody else be making scenarios up with the type of look they have or the type of wig they have on? I do. Makes life so much more fun. So. Yeah, this is cute, y'all. Anyway, um, I don't know where I'm going to go take pictures. I'm probably just going to drive around and find a spot like I normally do. Um... So yeah, and I need to change out my battery pack before I leave because I'm going to be pissed if my battery dies. And then also I need to change out my SD card. So I'm about to do that. For all my um, YouTubers out there or Instagrammers, whatever, if you make Instagram videos or whatever the case. My eyebrow messing up. Uh -uh, we can't be having that. Anyway, um, I got this four pack battery charge. And it came with an actual charger, like the one that you can plug into the wall, you can plug into your car, and it came with four battery packs for like 20 bucks, y'all. So I have technically, I have four batteries in rotation, which is so much better because I used to hate how I had to take breaks and it would just stop my whole flow. And I hate stopping my whole flow, especially when I'm in the recording groove and stuff. So if you're a YouTuber and you need extra batteries like check out amazon um i have a canon t5i rebel and so um i got batteries that were compatible but i like how you can also plug it into your car so it's like a dual battery system or whatever the hell i don't know but it's it's dope okay um like right now i have it plugged in the wall so and I labeled them one through four, so then I would know the difference between them as far as uh, what battery needed to be charged, what battery I'm using, et cetera, et cetera. So I just tried to take pictures at this location and it did not go the way that I wanted it to because like my camera keeps flashing super light and I don't know why. So I think it's the, I honestly think it's the cast, like, it's creating this shadow. Like, I don't know how to explain it. So I mess with my ASOS, like ISO, ISO, and I messed with, uh, the exposure, like how much light can be let in at a I feel like you're not gonna know what I'm talking about. 
I honestly feel like the fl I don't know what it is, but it's just making me too light. Like I don't have any color. Like y'all can't even see my blush on my face. Like it just looks white, and I don't know why. So I'm about to try a different location, play with my camera a little bit, and see what happens. So I don't know. So I'm back home, y'all, and my brother's about to make me a smoothie. So I'm about to eat a smoothie. It's a protein, protein smoothie. It's really, really good. He won't let me tell y'all the recipe for some reason. He's like staring at me. Will you let me tell them the recipe or no? No. So, <laughs> I'm sorry. It's like a family secret at this point. Um, but it's so good. I hate to rub it in y'all's face, but it's so good. Like, it's so good. Like, I didn't even know protein shakes could taste like this. Like, I'm not even over exaggerating. Like, no bitter taste, aftertaste. It tastes so good. Like, it's so, so, so good. I will say it has nuts in it and it has bananas in it. I just got done with the Stairmasters. I can't even think because I'm, I'm freaking tired. And I get on the Stairmasters every time that I come into the gym. I do. 20 minutes and I try to get a thousand steps in I just never show y'all that part because I feel like it's so repetitive so now I'm doing legs today so I'm doing a leg press home and I am about to edit and then later today I'm going to be going to um, the Express store I just talked to them on the phone and I called the Plaza if you guys don't know where that is in Kansas City like it's just a sh shopping center and they did not have the extended size like so I'm gonna have to go to Overland Park because the lady explained to me like it's the top 100 store or whatever or it's in the top 100 I can't even talk it's in the top 100 express store or whatever but the one on the plaza is not so they're not going to get the extended line until much later so I have to drive all the way out to Overland Park it's really not that far from where I am but it kind of is but it kind of isn't but anyway so I'm gonna head out there I already called them to make sure that they had the line in store and they do they just don't have the they just don't have talls so I'm just going into the store because I need to figure out what size I am like I don't know what size I am you know express runs small I need to figure out if I need to get a 16 or an 18 I may be an 18 at express just because they run small or I may be a true 16 in express it just depends so that's why I feel like I need to go there and like really try on the clothes to see how the fitting is before I actually get the items that I want online like I already have stuff picked out in my cart but I'm just like what size am I really like I recently made a tweet saying how do you explain to someone that you're like a size 16 in the waist 18 in the hips and then a 10 in the bust area so it's like what size am I really and I'm looking at the sizing chart and my body is like all over the place all over the place so it's like okay like what size am I like what size am I it's just so annoying it's like what size am I so that's on my agenda today I'm also gonna be posting a vlog and I'm gonna edit a regular programming type video I forgot what the video just like a little update talk chit chat type video so expect that for me and yeah so I'm gonna edit for I'm gonna at least try to edit up until I finish like my vlog post my vlog and then I'm gonna run to the Express store and then I'm gonna come back no I'm probably going to <laughs> finish my vlog post my vlog and then i'm gonna make me something to eat and then i'm gonna run to the express store try on some stuff and then i'm gonna come back and edit and then later tonight i'm going to the gym to do cardio so yeah that's on my agenda for today and then i'm also going to respond to some emails okay y'all so i'm in my closet 
don't be looking all around in here because it's a hot mess, okay? Like, I got shit everywhere. But anyway, I just wanted to come on here. Hold on. What the hell? I just wanted to come on here and show y'all my size 16 freaking pants because I know when I, I don't know how this journey is going to go when I go to Express. Y'all see me? Can you, <laughs> can you see me? Okay. The, these are, these are 16 and they don't stay up on my waist because, let me show y'all. In the back, they could probably be taken in a little around the waist. Like I always have this issue right here. Y'all see that? Okay. So I don't know how me going into Express is going to go. I don't know how it's going to go. But I'm a true 16 regardless of what Express says. And sometimes ladies, like you got to have these pep talks, you know, before you go into these stores. This is why I like to shop online. But just because you are a bigger size in one store, a smaller size in this store, and maybe a bigger size in another store, it doesn't it doesn't really it doesn't define you. Like at the end of the day, if you like what you see in the mirror, that's all that matters. The sizing is just that. Like it's just to see what your body can fit in at this particular brand or department store, okay? That's how you have to look at it. Like when I was a kid, I used to wonder like how the hell am I like a, a 12 at Old Navy? But um, I'm trying to think. When I went to Buckle, I think I was like a, a freaking 16 at Buckle or 14 at Buckle. This is like back in the day. Like I think I was trying to get some Lucky, was it Lucky Jeans or Lucky Charm? I don't even know the brand anymore, but I just remember how I was like a, a 12 at Old Navy, but when I went to go get those particular jeans, I had to get a 16. So it was like some ridiculous size. I don't remember y'all, but I'm just saying like different brands, different sizing. It does not define who you truly are. Um, just as long as you like what you see in the mirror, that's all that really matters. That's it. That's all that matters. Hold on. Let me turn my air down because y'all not going to be able to hear me. Y'all, tell me why I'm in traffic. I'm pissed. Y'all, I hate traffic. First of all, I hate driving. Like, let's be serious. You know what I like? I like being chauffeured. I like to be chauffeured. Let me sit in the back seat and chauffeur me around. And I can take me a nap. I can read. I can write reminders in my calendar book. Like... I hate driving. I can't be the only one. I hate it. I hate it so much. Oh my gosh. I freaking hate it. But yeah, I'm that type of girl. Like, let me sit in the back seat. You drive me around. I can read. Like, I can get stuff done until I get to my destination. Like, just let me know when we get there. That's why I feel like I'm more of a city girl because, you know, I'm cool with riding whatever public transportation because I just feel like it just... Driving is such a waste of time to me. I hate driving. Okay, y'all, so I am in Express, and this is a large jumpsuit. One thing that I did notice is that they didn't have that many XL and up <laughs> when it came to like dresses, skirts, and jumpers. So you may just have to order online, but this is what a large looks like. This is a large. Hopefully you guys get an idea of what size you need to get. A large isn't bad, but as you can see, it's not long enough at the bottom. Like, look at that. It's high waters. Not cute. Okay, y'all, this is an 18. And look at the gap in the back. So, I don't know. So their pants run small, um, kind of sucks, but it is what it is. So I don't even know. 